Hey guys, it's Tracy and you're watching TakeOver TV. Today and every day, I commit to taking over my life. Are you taking over yours? I wanted to talk to you guys today about challenging yourself and pushing yourself to the limits. Um, kind of getting outside of your comfort zone. I feel like unless you're challenging yourself and pushing yourself, you're never really going to go anywhere. Sometimes I think we believe we're doing okay. Um because we're comfortable and, and we're doing what we, we think that we should be doing. But we have to stop and think like, are we really pushing ourselves? Because if not, we're never really gonna grow. Um, even with like my weight loss journey, I feel like I'm pushing myself sometimes and then sometimes I'm just kind of going with the flow just to get it done. And it's good to at least stay on track, but if you're not actively pushing yourself, if you're not aware of where you are at the moment and knowing where you want to be, then you can't grow. And it goes beyond, like I always say, it goes beyond a weight loss journey. This is anything in life. If uh, you work at a job and you want to be in a higher position in order to do that, you have to push yourself above what you're doing, even if it is your everyday activities and you're doing everything that you're supposed to do. Sometimes you have to push yourself a little bit further. Um, just to go back to health and fitness as an example, when you're trying to build muscle, the muscles actually have to tear down and break apart in order for them to grow. So that's kind of what you have to do with yourself. You have to push yourself past the limit of you being comfortable. And sometimes you, you kind of have to feel out there and broken down and like you don't exactly know what you're doing in order to grow and improve because if you're in your comfort zone and you're doing what you already know, you're not growing. So every day, I think we should all commit to taking a step in the right direction, taking a step further in order to improve ourselves. It doesn't have to be a drastic leap every day, but if you commit to pushing yourself every day, then you're able to go a little bit further and you're able to grow stronger and anything that you want to do, whether it be weight loss, whether it be a, a personal goal of yours to something I'm doing now is to drink more water. Even that, I have to actually push myself because I'm not used to drinking as much water. So it kind of gets uncomfortable. Your, your stomach is uh, extremely full. You have to keep running to the bathroom and it's to the point where it's uncomfortable. But if I know that I need to drink more water in order to be healthy and to be at the level that I need to be at with my health and fitness, then that's something that I have to do. So it could be something as small as that. And then you can just progressively get um, deeper with your goals. You can keep pushing forward to do more with your goals. You can start small and then see where you want to go. But I mean, the moral of the story is like, push yourself and go as far as you can go because at the end of the road when you get there it'll really be worth it you'll be proud of yourself and you'll know that you deserve whatever you were going to get because you worked for it it wasn't just something that just came by randomly and something good that happened to you no you worked for it and you appreciate what you've gotten because you put in the work so every day, guys, try to make a commitment to push yourselves and to grow. You can leave a comment down below and let me know what you do to push yourself every day, uh, what you've done to push yourself and how it makes you feel afterwards. Do you feel like, oh, it was all for nothing? Do you feel like at the end of the road, it was something that you gained? It was a good journey that you were on and you're proud of yourself. How do you feel at the end of the day? You guys, leave a comment below and let me know how you feel about that. Let me know how you push yourselves and I'll talk to you guys later.